Hey everyone! Welcome back to Wealthy Coin. Vitalik Buterin gives Shiba Inu CoinShib news today, huge chance. Shiba Inu Coin, the price of the second largest cryptocurrency in the world, hasn't changed much in the past 30 days. Due to the recent market crash, the price of SHIB keeps going down, but a recent change has made people more interested in the Shiba Inu coin, which could drive up its price. In this video, we'll talk about how Vitalik Buterin has given Shiba Inu coin a huge chance. Don't forget to give us a big thumbs up, share the video, and subscribe to the channel to see the latest Shiba Inu price predictions and expert analysis. So, let's start the video right away. According to the Shiba archives, Binance wants to add more Shiba Inu coins to its holdings to make them bigger. The largest cryptocurrency exchange in the world will add SHIB coin worth $76 million. Gabe said that Binance has tried to take over the digital assets of Voyager. In the news release, the deal was said to be worth about $1.22 billion. But this big news came at a time when its reserves were getting more and more bad press. Voyager said that Binance Aussie's bid on its assets was the highest and best. This deal also comes with an extra payment that could be worth up to $20 million. Nansen said that Binance would add $76 million worth of Shiba Inus and other assets to its bid to buy Voyager's assets. Also, it will add $255 million worth of Ethereum and $62 million worth of tokens. The tracker said that the Shiba Inu coin burn rate has jumped by 600% in the last 24 hours, which Coingate said. In just four mega transactions, 27.2 million Shiba Inu coins have been burned. The market cap of the second biggest mean cryptocurrency is still more than $4.5 billion. The price of a Shiba coin has gone down by 3% in the last 30 days, but the price of a ship has gone up a little bit in the last 24 hours. At the time of this writing, the average price of a Shiba Inu is $0.08. Cents. Its 24-hour trading volume is $58 million, which is only $352 million. This December, a Shiba Inu worth $3,000 has moved into the burn address, with just more than a week left. It's a 99% drop from May of this year, when $260,000 worth of 31 billion Shibas burned. Investors celebrated the opening of the burn portal on ShibaSwap in May of this year. It was a way for people who burned to get passive income as a reward. Shiba Inu Shib fans burned more than $260,000 worth of Shiba Inu Shib. And it looked like the rate of burning was about to go off the rails, but the burn portal didn't come through. In October, the burn portal was taken over by Chip's lead development team, which is led by Shichitoshi Kazama. A blog post explains what needs to be done to the burn portal before it can be used again in 2023. It could be a sign that Shiba Inu burning will be back on track in 2023. Is the Layer 2 blockchain solution for SHIB? Shibarium Shitoshi Kusama confirmed that some of the money from transaction fees would be used to burn Shiba Inu. Shibarium is one of the most important things that will happen in Shiba Inu in 2023 and good news about burning it could cause the supply to go down and the price to go up a lot. During the crypto run of 2021, the market capitalization of SHIB was mostly the same as its price over its entire history. By October 2021, its market value had reached a high of $41 billion. SHIB's market cap never fell below $16.5 billion in 2021. During the crash in Q2 2022, its market cap fell below $4.5 billion by the middle of June. At the moment, its market cap is just over $5.38 billion, which makes it the 13th biggest cryptocurrency. A blog post from Changely said that after looking at the prices of SHIB and how the market changes, experts think that the price of SHIB could go as high as $5.48 and as low as $4.183. Its potential ROI for the said year is predicted to be 322%, with its average price remaining at $4,335. Telegen agreed and found that some crypto experts say the price of Shiba Inu coins could reach a new level in 2025. On the other hand, they don't think the price will go up in 2022, even though they think enough tokens will be burned this year. They think that the highest price for SHIB will be $1,928 and the lowest price will be $9,839. Its average price was predicted to be around $1,152. 
Recently, Russian Canadian computer scientist Vitalik Buterin, who is best known as the father of Ethereum, named what he believes are three of the biggest opportunities in crypto at the present time. In an interview for episode 149 of the Backlist podcast, which came out earlier this week, Butterini said, If you can make a wallet that a billion people will use, that's a huge opportunity. If you can make a stable coin that can actually survive anything up to and including a US dollar. Hyperinflation is also a huge chance to make money. If you can make something that will help everyone in that situation, if you can get signed in with Ethereum to work, and if you can get rid of Facebook, Google, and Twitter as the login kings of the internet, that's a huge opportunity, right? On the 5th of December 2022, Buterin shared his thoughts on Ethereum's diverse ecosystem in a blog post titled What's in the Ethereum Application Ecosystem Excites Me. Butterin wrote, My excitement about Ethereum is now no longer based in the potential for undiscovered unknowns, but rather in a few specific categories of applications that are proving themselves already and are only getting stronger. He then talked about the five types of applications that interested him most as a result of the merge. Transactions are added to the chain much faster and the chain has become more stable, making it safer to accept transactions after fewer confirmations. Scaling technology such as Optimistic and ZK rollups is proceeding quickly. The social comeback with account abstraction, multi-sig wallets can be used more often. As technology improves, it will take years for these trends to become clear, but progress is already being made. I see the stablecoin design space as being roughly divided into three groups. Centralized stablecoins, stablecoins that are backed by real-world assets and are controlled by the DAO. From the user's point of view, the three types of crypto-backed stablecoins are spread out along a spectrum between efficiency and stability. Decentralized finance, in my opinion, started out as a good but limited idea, grew into an overcapitalized monster that relied on unsustainable methods of yield farming, and is now just starting to settle down into a stable medium and improve security and we're focused on a few useful applications. With the sign-in with Ethereum standard, users can log into traditional websites in a way that is similar to how you can do it today with your Google or Facebook account. This is very helpful. It lets you use the site without giving Google or Facebook access to your personal information or the power to take over your account or lock you out. Users can have their own names. I have Vitalik F proof of humanity and other ways to prove that I'm a person allow users to prove that they are unique people. This is useful for many things like airdrops and government. Most of the time, a DAO is a smart contract that is meant to show how an asset or process is owned or controlled. But this structure could be anything from the simple multi-sig to highly complex